This morning, after nearly three weeks of testimony, the James Boyd murder trial is drawing to a close. Attorneys on both sides will make their closing arguments today. Then the case will go to a jury. Now, KOAT Action 7 News reporter Sasha Leninger, you've been following this case yep. for the last three weeks. Now, the last witness yesterday, that was a big one. Yeah, that last witness was actually one of the two former officers with Albuquerque right. Police Department charged with second degree murder. Now, that retired officer is APD Detective Keith Sandy. He testified on his own yesterday. He described what he saw and heard before he and former officer Dominic Perez shot and killed James Boyd in 2014. Sandy testified he did not know that the original reason APD confronted Boyd is because he was reported as an illegal camper. Sandy said that all he was told was that a man threatened officers with knives. Now, prosecutors have been arguing that Boyd was trying to surrender at the time he was shot. So, of course, Sandy was asked about that. Try to protect. Did it ever appear to you after Mr. Boyd drew his knives that final time that he was surrendering? No, ma'am. Sandy also testified that he believed that the police canine handler was in danger when he and Perez opened fire on Boyd. He said that he saved that handler's life. Sandy's defense team rested their case after he testified. Now coming up in our next half hour, I'll tell you about one of the key witnesses who never made it to the stand. Todd. All right, Sasha.